Uh, yeah, a lot of families. Like in, in this area right across the road, the uh, wartime houses, there was 83 kids just in this two blocks area. Because to get a wartime house, you had to uh, be a veteran and have and be married and have at least one child. Well, it's funny because like, you look at them, they're only 850 square feet. But um, Bing Raven, he had five girls and Percy Howes, he had five boys. They were side by side, you know, but there was 83 kids just in a two block area. And, and, a, and a, a friend of mine, the, my best friend, Brian Howes, he was a Percy and, and Frank were brothers. He lived on John Street and they had a, a, a very small house and they had eight, eight kids. And so they built a new house right next to it within 10 feet of the house. Well, before they tore the old house down, they rented it to the mayors who had seven kids. So there was 15 kids on one lot at, at the least of them. Well, they all had friends in that coming over. So sometimes you'd have 20 or 30 kids playing there. And you know, so there was always, you always had a football game going or a baseball game or, or tag or hide and seek, you know. Because uh, there, there, so there were so many kids in town. And there were so many things like um, the, the One Mile Creek that goes through the wilderness. We were always at the One Mile. My mother would always tell me when I was going out, stay away from that creek. Oh, yes, Mama, stay away from the creek. Well, of course, we went to the creek, you know, and, and, you, would, and you would play there until you got a soaker. And then you'd have to come home and hang your head and, well, I couldn't, I couldn't help myself. I slipped in here or whatever, you know. <laughs> but the creek was like a magnet. The one mile creek and, and the two mile creek. We would uh, go to the, the one and the two and build rafts and float on them. And, yeah, yeah. Well, first is the one that goes right through town, right through the what we call the wilderness. That was Mrs. Parker's property between between Center and Mary Street, creek flows right through there. Yeah, and that, that's called the wilderness because when we were kids, we were convinced there were still gorillas living in there because it was so wild and overgrown. And, you know, and of course, we, we didn't know where the gorillas went in the wintertime, but in the summertime, <clears throat> we were afraid to go in there because we thought, oh, there's, you know, there's gorillas in there. But we used to go to the, the one mile creek, of course, with the magnet, the two mile, and as you got a little older, you ventured a little further away. So eventually we went to the four mile pond, which is a, like the two mile pond, the four mile pond. They were great for skating in the wintertime and that, but during the summer they were great for rafts and building. And, the, and even the trek there was, was half the fun, you know. 